All right, welcome back to another one. We're back in Wayfinders today. Oh, this game's so much fun. I played a little bit after our last video. Um, just a little bit of grind to get some extra stuff. Um, also did some research and kind of found some new locations, but we have a couple missions on hand here. So we're gonna go check out our new house. This game has an apartment that you can get and you can actually fill it up with customizable items and stuff like that. So let's head in there and check it out. I wonder if you can upgrade your house and get a bigger space. It's not that you need it because it doesn't really matter, but it's kind of cool. Maybe we might have some items to try out maybe. Let's see, a bed. Tools. Okay. <clears throat> housing apartments. Your apartment is your own space to call home skylight. Like various types of decorative and house housing items that customize the look of your apartment. Sometimes some items will also grant additional gameplay benefits when placed. Artifacts, unique crafted items which grant persistent gameplay buffs, artifact management settings. Cool, this is kind of neat. Now I don't have any artifacts, but hopefully find some. We actually check that out too. So our plan here today is we're gonna jump into the portal and run around. We are gonna gather some items first though. After I finish recording our last video, I was just kind of looking around, checking stuff out, try to understand the game better. I found out I actually can go down to discoveries and I can go over to recipe book and I can look at all these different items, accessories, imbuements, consumables. I looked at the accessories and I was looking for items that have mainly crit power damage and uh, break power. I wasn't sure what mag defense was or what break power was. I found out mag defense is mitigates ability power from enemies. So if they have a power up of some sort, it'll decrease the damage on that. Break power is how fast you can break the enemy's shield slash resilience. So we definitely want to have crit power. We want break power. And we also want weapon power for our rifle because we are going to be going for a classic ranger build going for crit damage we also got some new stuff too which i will show in a minute here so i actually upgraded my character i love my character up and i got a new ability which is a decoy so this will actually distract enemies and allow me to engage them which is going to help us a lot too especially when we're going to be trying to go for those crit hits we can focus targets down so we're going to head over to the shopping district we have a decent amount of money. We have 3,222. We're going to go and buy an item from the engineer. You're going to craft an item that I want to use, the Conqueror's Chain. Put that away for now. We're going to head over to Venge, I think it is, or Venge, Venge. And we're going to buy the Jade Crane, which gives us 279 crit rating. And then we're going to go over to our character. And this is where I can update and change whatever I want. Through some of the missions we completed, we did get a new rifle. So we have a level four ransom. We also got this gloom touch bracelet, which just gives us physical defense, which would be great. We're going to add on the jade and we're going to add on the conqueror's chain. Attach these items here, the conqueror's chain and the jade crane. We now have 115 crit power, 144 crit rating and 144 break power. With the jade crane, we have 239 crit rating. So that brings us up to 420. But it's definitely want to make those so we can start working on our actual build that we want to work with. I would like to get a new weapon, and I did see there was a, or actually a currency you can use in the vault. There's a vendor actually inside the, the dungeon. You can use these to buy certain items. And I saw a sniper rifle. I don't know if it's a skin or if it's actually a gun I can use. Uh, so I would like to get that eventually, but we'll get that, we'll get there eventually. The other thing we did make changes to too, we echoed our main character and our rifle. So now we have a herald, break power and mag defense on our rifle. And we also got the goblin seer, Ability power and mag defense. Ability power should affect our grenade we throw. So that'll be good for hitting more damage on the groups of enemies that we'll be facing off with. And we also get additional mag defense, which mitigates ability power that we get from the enemies. So that'll be good. This is where I can change my abilities. So we have Proton Clone. We'll drop in, they'll attack it. Uh, we can upgrade more of these as we go. But yeah, we're looking pretty good so far. Let's head into the portal and start this raid. We're going to hold off on the Broodmother. We'll do that next mission, our next video. I want to see if we can get some more upgrades in the Codex Halls. Have some fun. Oh, let's get some sources. There's one over there. Yeah. All this current is going to help us out eventually to get upgrades and stuff. So we'll try to get as much as we can. We can keep upgrading. All right. Oh. Let's try out the decoy. Let's get it here. Ooh, let's dodge that. Light 
down. Got leveled up, nice. Okay. Should we check for everything? Note to self, there's traps. I did not even notice that, so we're gonna <laughs> keep that in mind, that's for sure. Okay, so we got... How can I... There's also new, like, little puzzles you can do. We're gonna take out these spiders first. taken care of. Nice! Let's go! So we got an echo. We can put that in our rifle and then just gain additional uh, crit rating. Right, so our object here is we're going to try and, I believe it's going to move that ball there. This one here. So we're going to try and get to that other empty space there. I think that'll work. The next one. I'm going to try and get it right there. Nice. Next one. <laughs> Got the last one. Oh, shoot, I missed it. Okay. So we're trying to get to the right side there, right over here. Nice, got it. Now this will unlock a chest, I believe. Oh, hi, you're big. Whoa. She jump scared me. Cross your grenades. Let's open up a new chest. Right, let's see what we get. 
let's go. Is that a blue? I still got some more orbs too, which is good. Any here, that's kind of cool. Weapon skin. All right. It looks like we got a higher level. Oh wait, this one's slightly. Oh. Okay, so that's a big upgrade actually. You see, this is where we're using. We have one echo slot, and a capacity of eight. This new one has looks like two echo slots. One looks like it's for defense, and one looks like it's for fire. It has a lot more echo capacity, which is going to allow us to put heavy ones in there. We also have an additional weapon power, ability power, and crit power, and higher an additional physical defense, crit rating, and mag defense. So that's good. That's a big win right there. Let's keep going. We're going to try and fully complete this dungeon. If we keep going, there's going to be a couple more rooms. Can I actually see how many rooms are there? Heading that way. There's a chest in here. Nice. Oh, God. So there is. I forget what they call them, but they're mimics, I think, right? Down. Let's see what we get. Baby Deceiver. <laughs> That's awesome. Cool. cool. They're actually kind of hard. I was kind of surprised. I mean, not only we're just level 5, so we're not that high a level, but they definitely have a lot of health. Oh. See, I gotta look out for this stuff. I, I need to pay more attention. Oh, what is this? Picked up a random item. I see engineer and skylight about the ring. Okay, cool. I see. Is he here? Make sure there's no more spectre. Spectra. Oh, skeleton key, huh? Okay, interesting. Why does this look like a trap? Hold on. Oh, is that a puzzle? Oh, look at this. That's kind of cool. Oh, we got some uh, a brute crystal acre and a uh, gray stone. I really want to open this chest. It looks so cool.
Nice, got him. This door opens. Grab this chest. Oh, over the architects. Wow, okay, that seems really good. Mini gong toy. Okay, we're getting some cool stuff. Back here. Uh oh. Yeah, I guess we're gonna spin the wheel. Oops. Okay, cool. I'll take it. Wow, that's awesome. Some more money. Yeah, so it's cool little things like that, like little mini games within the, the dungeons, which I think are really neat. Let's go. We just got a bunch of good stuff in like a matter of seconds. Alright, it's gonna be a fun run to get out of. This looks like a ambush area. This won't take long. Yep. Let's do our These guys explode, it looks like. Nice. Got another echo. And another echo. Nice. Let's head over here. Dropping in. Nice. Oh, we got chests right here. Deep wood fletching. Black Star, nice. Another potion and spectrum. We time this perfectly. Oh. Nice. Oh, another orb, nice. I swear I thought I saw a big dude down here. Oh, here we go. Encoded tracer. Huh. Seemed a good tracer. I don't know what that is exactly, but we'll find out. Also, we are. Let's see it. Need one more of these. We need one more of these orbs to actually get that sniper I saw. So we'll have to keep an eye out. Okay, no like blue. Oh, that's big defense. All right, let's head to the last room. Oh. Oh, you know what it is? It might be a respawn beacon. Don't you? Don't have him. All right. This won't take long. I'm gonna get them all down somewhat low and then I'll pop my decoy. They won't have to. Another dungeon down. Cool, nice. We got a solar a solar impugment, memory fragment, and ransom. We also got all these items here. I 
kind of excited to see what this is all about, Eddie. We also got some nice echoes here. We got two of those. We got the Trickster coin. I'm not sure what that's for. We got Encoded Tracer. Also not sure what that is. And then we got the Gloom Trace. The Gloom Touch crown. And these orbs. These orbs look pretty good too. We got some new rifles. Oh, so they're different echoes. Okay. Just so we have. Let's take a look at what we got here. Let's go over to here. The upgrade. We're going to check out a new ability. Alright, so we have Arc Nemesis. Silo sends out an egg. Shock all enemies in the area, dealing a burst of damage. Egg remains in the area for a short time, slowing and damaging nearby enemies. Okay, it's kind of nice. Oil Bomb. Leaves a pool of oil in front of the silo, slowing enemies. Enemies directly hit by a bomb are also oiled. Staying slowed even after leaving the oil pool. Taking additional damage when ignited by Fire Bomb. Crushes a charge of Fire Bomb. Okay. I feel like Arc Nemesis would be really good for like an AoE, but I think for what we're going for, we're going to rock the oil bomb when they're ignited by the fire bomb. So let's do that. I'm going to upgrade our decoy. And our level one increases duration of the clone by 25%. That's going to be really nice. It'll allow me to take more shots in the heads. These can also have slots. Oh, wow. So you could really dive into a lot of build theory. I love that. All right, so we definitely want to use this one for sure. We don't have any rush, so we can't do that. And we don't have any defense, so we can't do that. Oh, we'll just leave that alone for now. We did get some additional items. We got the Spracer of Emery's. Weapon power, crit rating, and mag defense. All pretty good stuff. We might switch that out for the crown. I guess the crowns do give us defense, so that gives us weapon power, crit rating, and mag defense. Where the Conqueror's Chain gave us crit power, crit rating, and break power. It's a set bonus. Okay. Looks like if we get the Gear 2 Spare Cogs and the Shoals Amulet. If we have two, we get 5% total crit power resilience. And if we get all three, we get 10% total crit power resilience. Do you feel like with our decoy, we probably can take off the Gloom Conquerors, but let's see what these are. These have echoes too. Oh, that's right. Oh, uh, we're gonna go in on this one. So that one there gives crit rating and crit power. If this one too, Brood Spawn. Okay, so our crit rating is really high right now and our crit power is pretty good and our break power is pretty good. Weapon power is doing really well too. All feeling good about this. Nice. Big upgrades. Pretty stoked about that. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.